The knockdown drill we like to use is five versus three, with the feeder behind the goal, below the GLE, and then four offensive targets he can throw the ball to with three defensemen. So this man behind the goal, he's got a pile of balls, and he can push either side. He can rotate back and forth through X. And he's told, take chances. He can look into that crease. We want that crease to be active. The backside two defenders have to be responsible for the crease and be looking for any type of through pass that might get thrown through. So they've got to have their sticks up, knocking that down, but yet be ready for that short pass into the crease, and they've got to take responsibility for that. You know, it's, it's not easy being a man down guy. It's the art of playing two. Can one man guard two? Can you take care of the crease, but if the ball's thrown through the defense or over the top, can you knock that pass down? These guys get a lot of reps with it. This man is in an adjacent skip lane. In our defense, we'd be calling him a one, and these guys would probably be called twos. He wants to try to be in that skip lane, ready to knock that pass down or pick it off, but also ready to move out if the pass is thrown up the side. So you'll see us also employ this drill quite a bit. And again, let me reinforce, I don't want X just on one side. I want him rotating through so that the defense would have to migrate. And stay with me as I get rid of these passes. And so what you would hopefully see as this man is this defender push up a little bit and him push down the backside a little bit. And now again, trying to get no skip lanes and these guys being our twos, him becoming a one and, um, and understand the role and responsibility they have with our man down defense. Here we go. One, one, one. Oh. Oh, that's over the top. Now Todd, you should be flying up there. Alex, let him go up there. Todd, don't get locked in that crease. Oh, Todd, you got on that crease, Todd. Nice knockdown.